Hey guys, in today's video, we're gonna be going over YouTube video ads for excavation and septic contractors. So if you're new to the channel, uh, we are dedicated to the growth of excavation and septic businesses. And we have uh, some nice free resources for you to help you grow your business, just click the link below this video and you can get access to those. You'll see quick links. Click on that, you'll see something like this and that will give you access to all these resources. So let's go ahead and get into it. With uh, YouTube video ads for excavation and septic contractors, uh, you have some pretty cool targeting options for the ideal jobs you want. And I'm gonna get into that and show you how we can set that up. So let's go ahead and do that now. I'm gonna share my screen with you. And with the YouTube video ads, uh, a lot of times people shy away from it because they, they say to themselves, well, I don't have a video. So I'm gonna show you actually how you can set these ads up without having any video. And that's a major benefit to running this type of campaign. And what's cool is YouTube is actually the second largest search engine behind Google. So your customers are there, they are looking for your services. And I'm gonna show you how to target jobs on YouTube uh, right now. So for instance, you can enter right here uh, a location. So let's say, for instance, that you wanted to target um, Montgomery County in uh, Alabama. Oops, let me spell that right. You could do it that way. That's one way that you could uh, target customers. Now, let's say you wanted to target specifically a radius around your address, wherever you're at. You could do this. You could click advanced search and get rid of that. And they have a radius option here where you can actually type in your address and set this to as far as you're willing to go. So that's pretty cool, right? Uh, so that's a nice way to make sure that you are reaching the customers in your service area and and uh, you know not going outside of that, this works really well. Um, you can choose languages. So you could put in here English only, Spanish only. And then if you're looking to generate leads, which most of you are, uh, set this to maximize conversions. And then a daily budget, you know, whatever you can work with is fine. I recommend starting out at no less than $20. And we'll get into uh, networks and site links in another video, uh, but also additional settings here. Um, you can schedule the ads to go seven days a week. You can schedule them Monday through Friday. And uh, so you have some different options there. So I'm gonna set up some of this and then move on to the next step. Now, the next part of this is where we're gonna get into some pretty advanced targeting of carving out your ideal customers and attracting those high value excavating projects. So let's go ahead and, and look at some of this. So like for instance, create audience lets you kind of really fine tune uh, who you're targeting. So if we uh, click on interests and detailed demographics, we can type in things like, um, if we do selling home or purchasing a home, you'll see here it has life event. And so people that are looking to perhaps um, do some lot clearing or fix up their yards or, or clear their lots and things like that, uh, this is a way to, to reach those people. Uh, purchasing a home, that would be an option. A recently renovated home, renovating a home soon. The, this is good for a couple reasons. Is one, um, especially if you're targeting uh, residential excavating projects, you want homeowners, right? And so by 
by looking uh, by targeting these specific options of purchasing a home or re or renovating a home or recently recently moved is in my opinion not that great because um, we don't know if they're homeowners home renovation would be another good one okay so I would I would these are just some options to toy with right uh, but I would definitely look into testing these and we also want to target people that are in a lot of cases high end that can afford to do bigger projects so to do that we could go ahead and click on demographics right here and if you change the age range on this um, you might get flagged and the reason being is discriminatory practices and things like that um, you can go for it. The worst thing that happens is really they'll reject the ad and they'll tell you why. Um, but it's worth a shot testing this out as well and seeing if you can carve out an age range. Like typically 18 year olds are not going to be uh, buying lot clearing and demolition and things like that, right? So we, we can try changing this. So we can set the age to say uh, say 25 plus additional demographics here's where we can actually carve out income okay so we can target um, people that have top 10 percent income to lower 50 percent uh, we want people that can afford high value projects right so i would not go below the 50 percent mark okay and so here's an option you can save these so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and we will skip forward to the next section. Now, the next part here we see is optimized targeting. And this is very similar if you've ever ran Facebook ads to uh, lookalikes. And so this, is, this uses Google's machine learning AI to target people outside of these settings that might also be a good fit. And for instance, Google, they have data on all of us. Unless you're totally living in a cave and you don't search online, they have data on you. They know, you know what you're interested in. They know if you are potentially moving or if you're looking to renovate a property through the videos you watch, the sites you visit, and your research, and so on. So I would recommend trying this out, testing it for a bit. You could always turn it off. Uh, but there, there's no reason not to do it. And they even say 20% more conversions happen, 20% more leads by leaving this turned on. Okay, so now we get into some of the fun part, and that is creating the ad. And now if you've already got uh, some good video of your work, you can use that. But if you don't, there's no need to worry because you can actually create really cool videos right inside uh, YouTube's video ad editor. So I'm going to uh, get started on some of that and uh, we'll go through it together. OK. OK, so here we're in the video editor of uh, Google ads of YouTube. They have different templates that you can use. And you might be saying to yourself, well, geez, you know, none of these look like they would work for excavating contractors or septic companies. Again, don't worry because you can add your own logo, your own images, and these end up looking really slick. So um, for instance, we will go through uh, some of this right now and, and set one up uh, so you can see how good they look. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. So I'm going to click on this one for fun. And you can see right away it says, okay, 10 images, a logo, and then five text areas. Okay, so we can go ahead and use this one. And it gives you something like this. So I'm going to start filling this out so you can see what it looks like. And then I will show you uh, the finished video in just a moment. And so here's a little snippet inside the uh, actual editor. I just wanted to show you this. And basically, you can add images. You can add music to it. And, and then you're off to the races. So I'll go ahead and, and play this uh, video for you. And you can, you can get an idea.
Okay, so we're moving on here. And the other cool thing about running YouTube video ads for excavation and septic is, um, you know, a lot of you don't actually have a YouTube channel. Um, the cool thing is you don't even need a YouTube channel to run these ads. You can actually host it on Google's uh, platform on their YouTube and run your ads that way to save you some time. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and, and continue with the process here. And so now we see it says your video is being uploaded. And what the uh, Google Ads video editor is doing is compiling the video for you right here. Now it gives you the link right here to your YouTube video and you can actually uh, share this on your Facebook page and, and in other resources, it, it will be live. So you can actually use this video. And so that's pretty much it. Um, YouTube ads, the great thing about it, it's a pretty much a blue ocean for excavation and septic contractors right now. There's not a whole lot of people in local markets doing it. And um, I don't know why, because really it's YouTube's the second largest search engine and people are going there to look for excavating services, uh, septic installations and so on to learn about uh, those services that you offer. So that's pretty much it. Thought this would be uh, helpful and pretty cool for some of you. And uh, comment below if you have any questions on YouTube ads or uh, video marketing for your excavation or septic contractor. We'd be happy to, uh, to answer those for you. And uh, let me know how it goes. Thank you so much. Have a great day.